NLC's Chalk It Up event on the lake is open to all students and faculty. Brett Dyer started the event six years ago. It dates back to like the Renaissance, and that, that's how a lot of artists would be discovered. From Modinari art to the exotic, chalk art is serious, whimsical for everyone. Just a bunch of June bugs, or like beetles. I kind of just came here randomly. I'm starting to have fun. Since the event fell on Earth Day this year, all entries had to celebrate Mother Earth in their pieces. It's like our child is, is protecting uh, Earth and such, basically. Supplies are provided to participants as they vie for prizes, but the inspiration is their own, and this could take a while. I was figuring that I would try to get it finished in the next, like, 20 minutes, but it's looking to be a little longer than I thought. It's okay if the rain washes it away or someone walks all over it or something, but it's kind of like a cathartic pain, you know? Something about all that color, that cool breeze off the lake, nature and art. I think it brings out color and it brings out like a lot of energy, it just gives you a good vibe for the day. This is our 12th one and it seems to be getting bigger and bigger. But there was no one prouder than NLC's Dean of Visual and Performing Arts. We've had to decrease the size of the spaces because we have so many entries. And so that's a wonderful problem for us to have. I always love looking at the students' artwork. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. I like it, yeah. I love chalk. It's amazing. And it takes me back to my childhood. Maria Howard, NLC News. I feel like right here. And then we do like a, a white one.